Hello, people. How are you? My name's Kev. This is Angling and Anxiety. It's all about the angling. It's about the anxiety. Right, welcome back guys. This is a bit of a surprise for you because you didn't know I was coming and I usually shout my mouth off and tell you I'm going, but I'm in Cornwall and I'm targeting sharks again. Um, the engine outboard, spot on there. Thanks and Simpson Marina absolutely went out of their way for me yesterday, massively. Um, literally, I turned up at five minutes before closing time. They stripped my whole engine, fitted the new part. Bang on, mate, happy days. Um, Got the unknown angler here, he's back to you. And we've got Charlie, good old Charlie, back in the room. Charles freezing, never seen Cornwall before. I'll show you the water clarity. Look at that. Our aim today is to be the first boat out there. Um, hopefully we are, if we're not, it ain't the end of the world, but we're feeling a lot more confident than we did the other day. So, fingers crossed, we can pull one out. We've got the daddy reels, the old winches, mate. All spooled up by big British big game fishing, Stuart Neal. Um, happy days. My hands are cold, so I'm gonna warm them up in my old heater. I've got the heater running. Um, just to let you know, I've got a first aid box, emergency flare and etc. Um, yeah, we're good to go. Different tactics today. Uh, got a bit more information on what we need to be doing. So we'll see how we get on. <laughs>
guys, we're on the spot. You can see the sun shining up the back. Absolutely beautiful, man. 10 out of 10. Um, really feeling positive at the end of the day right now. Uh, whether it works, who knows? It's not easy game of shark and lock. Um, but we know what we're up to. Unknown anglers, are, he's an experienced shark angler. I've had a couple of shark, well, I've had a shark um, and a tuna, so I know half know what I'm talking about, and I've done a bloody good research. So, what we want to hear is that, with a big juicy porgy on the end of it. So, let's keep an eye on a fish finder at the minute, I'll show you. Yeah. Let's see how we get on, and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Right, so guys, we've got three baits there. Um, we're fishing as hard to the bottom as we can. We tried different te te techniques last time. This time we're going for the bottom approach. We've caught the roof a couple of times so we know we're near enough on it. Um, we've done a bit of adjusting. And yeah, we've, we've got it to about spot on at the minute. One's over there drifting. And have a look at that sun, man. Whether you catch a fish or not here, yeah, coming to Cornwall is something special. I was absolutely struggling on the journey here, man. I've been driving all day yesterday at work and then had absolute nightmares. You wouldn't even believe the nightmares I had yesterday. I, God's honest truth, it was unbelievable. I basically, my back wheel in the van that we've drove all the way to Cornwall seized up. AA man come out, one AA man come out and told me I need recovering. Another AA, AA man come out, watch this line here. Um, this is, this is over, sorry, a bit of a float adjusting here. Yeah, yeah, it's got to go over. See, this is a drama as well. Um, but yeah, but one AA man come out, told me I'm never recovering. The other AA man come out, sorted my problem, and we've just drove it all the way to Cornwall. Uh, I've then lost my keys. I've then had to drive to the other side of Essex to get a uh, to get a um, part for my boat. Yeah. Then got the part for the boat and got it fitted at New Haven within the last five minutes, like I said a minute ago. Yeah, it's been pretty hectic, so I do deserve a fish. I've had the worst run of bad luck, but like I say, we're at Cornwall, we're winning. Happy days. So right, guys, I'm having a little lay down because I've done a lot of driving. The boys have had a kip, so it's my turn to lay down. Who's out there? Can't see it because I'm the windows need to clean. Charles caught 78 reefs so far. But yeah. <laughs> I'm probably leaving him into the roof. <laughs> but yeah, feeling confident, man. Feeling confident. I'm going to lay down and have a little bit of gravel and chill for half hour, I think. Try and get a bit of sleep. Look at that, boy. Look at that. Yeah. 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 Kevin. Right, porgy on, people. Porgy on. Okay. 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 I knew today was the day. I knew it. I am hurting people. I'm really hurting. Very, very, very clever fish. Away from the boat, it's on the boat. We're having to tow him. I'm on the leader now. Power, mate. Pure power. What a bando, man. This is what I drive for. This is what it's all about. Angling and anxiety to all the doubters, mate. Don't doubt angling and anxiety. Please believe me. Do not doubt me. Because I'm one determined little cookie. So determined. 
Oh, she's angry. She's angry. <laughs> That's what it's all about. That is on full strip 50W. Absolutely shaking his head. Ah, ah. Man against beast. Easy, don't go mad. He gained it and take it all back. Alright guys, we've got the fish here. I've had to let Glenn take it over because my arm hurts severely. Fish is coming up now. Lead or not? Lead up. Size of that. That is a big fish. A big, big, big fish. An angry, angry porgy. Wow! Straight in the scissors. Thank you very much. Lovely. Yes. Angry that anxiety, baby. Woo right, guys. I'm still catching my breath. I'm actually having a celebratory beer, and I don't really drink. I'm only having one because I've got to drive home. But my hand. So many people doubted me. So if you're watching this and you doubt me, never ever doubt me. I'm telling you, if I say I'm going to do something, I will do it. I've gone through trials and tribulations, mate, to get get here today. And oh, amazing, mate. Honestly, amazing. I don't even know what to say. This is for every single person out there. It feels like I can't do it. You can do it. Trust me, you can do it. Put your nut into it. The dramas I had yesterday feels like today. I should not. It should not have got here. I should not have happened. My wheel seized up. All kinds of dramas, mate. I drove 360 miles on the wheel that seized up. <sighs> Don't know what to say. I bloody love this place. Cornwall has made many, 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 many a dream. Big shout out to Simpson Marine in New Haven. Um, couldn't have done it without them boys. So yeah, happy days mate. Honestly, <laughs> gobsmacked. Let's get another one, eh? Show the doubters, you could do anything mate. Be it giving up drugs, be it getting your dream job, be it catching a poor beagle shark, but everyone thinks you can't catch. Everyone looking at me in my little three grand boat, laughing, trying to put me off sense I ain't daft mate I know my stuff I read I learn I learn and I learn a little bit more and I make stuff happen man and I ain't me blowing my own trumpet that's just me giving myself a little bit of gratification because I deserve it and I'll tell you what couldn't have done it with the unknown angler couldn't have done it with Charlie Shane team effort mate there was a point, I'll be honest, I held my hands up. I had to give my own rod over to Glenn. And I said, Glenn, please keep hold of that for five minutes because I'm in bits. Um, but yeah, amazing. Amazing stuff. Let's get another one. Look at that water, people. Honestly, you'd think we was a problem, wouldn't you? I love old Vigilant. Big shout out to Cast the Line as well um, for the shark rigs. In fact, we actually downsized on the hooks this time. Um, yeah, downsized on the, on the hooks, um, and it's done the business. I've still not quite got my head around it, I'm honest with you, I've still not quite got my head around it, but um, my left arm really hurts, so I haven't actually got a rod out in a minute. Uh, the boys have both got theirs out. Pretty, I'm pretty confident we're going to get another one. Well, I need a feeling, but we'll see, won't we? We'll see. But well, you'll know very soon. I won't know till the end of the day. But yeah, engines purr again. Big love, Simpson Marina, New Haven, mate. Sorted me right out. Without them, this couldn't have happened. See if we can catch another porgy, eh? I'm actually in bed, but <laughs> I'm in bed. I've had enough. I'm hurting. I really can't sleep, man. Right, the tide has turned, people. I've sort of recovered. I ain't had no sleep because I can't because I just keep watching videos of poor beagles over and over again. But <laughs> the balloons are back out. We are going to get the boys one, similar as that.
Like I said, had you seen a video, I couldn't have landed that fish without them. Literally, all three of us was on it at one point. The reel come undone. I'm slipping over the deck. I've got some hundreds of pounds worth of meat, as unknown angler likes to call it, coming towards us. See, when you look into that water and you see that creature coming up from the deep, honestly, there's no buzz like it. You just can't beat it. There's no matching it. No matter what you do in this world, there is no matching that. In the deep blue. Just be legends, really. Still don't know what to say. Still a bit gobsmacked. This video is going to be a bit here, there, and everywhere because, like, it's just sort of like cut, really. Not the best editing. I've never been the best editor, but I will say I will go to levels that other people won't go to. Please believe me. Next on the list is Fresher Shark. Let's get another porgy for now, eh? This is the life of it, guys, eh? This is the life. Unknown anglers on the uh, on the skipper in. Probably can't hear much to the wind, but one thing you've got to remember, guys, is as beautiful as this place is, and as clear as that water is, so that right now is ready to take your life. And you need to always, 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 always be careful, man. Always be careful. All right, guys. It's going to be the end of the video. Um, we're going to have one last drift, so if we do get one, happy days, you know what I mean? But uh, one last drift, we're going to go in. We've still got quite a bit of time until high tide, uh, five hours in fact, but we're going to make our way in. Um, the engine just, it's not, nothing wrong with the engine, but sometimes it just won't start, which is obviously not an ideal situation to be in when you're at sea. Um, so yeah, it's just a bit of a pain in the ass, but it's not the end of the world. We've had the porgy, um, we've made the dream reality, and we've proved all the doubters wrong, so happy days. It's not all about that, it's about the smile and the uh, just the buzz, really. But yeah, uh, gonna get ourselves in. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Um, fresh, fresh in this season next. Uh, that's, that's the next target. A few weeks, three, four weeks, we'll be out on them. Um, and I will get one. So don't forget to click the subscribe button. I'm not going to stop until I have achieved every single goal in the book. Take care everyone. Facebook page is always open. Message is always open any time of day. If you need a chat for your mental health or fishing, you know where I'm at. Big love.